Hi there, so I often get the question what kind of skincare and sunscreens that I use. Um, well, I use a lot of things, so I thought I'll start with the sunscreens because they are one of the most important things that you put on your face. So the two sunscreens that I really, really like are Tiso and the Epions, and both of these are tinted. One is a little bit blue in the color, or I mean, not blue, but more cold in the color, and the other one is a little bit more warm in the color. So Tiso is a little bit more warmer in the color, and Epions, the Daily Shield, is a little cooler in the color. And they're both sun blocks, so they block off the sun rays from your skin. And they both have titanium dioxide and zinc oxide in them. And that's the two ingredients that you really want to look for in a good sunblock. So uh, Tiso is a little warmer in the color and Tiso is also a primer. Um, it actually say that on here. So facial primer and sheer tint, um, titanium and zinc oxides, mineral sunscreen. And this is an SPF 40. Um, I really like this just because it doesn't sting your eyes if you get it in your eyes. Like if you're an active person or if you are on vacation at the beach and you get sweaty and then you kind of like rub your eye, this does not sting your eyes. That's why I really, really love it because I haven't found any other sunscreen that doesn't sting, you know, if you get uh, sweaty or if you're active and you like rub your eyes and it, you know, comes down in your eye. Uh, so Tiso, I love, love, love. Uh, Epions is a really nice one as well. It's SPF 50. This one, um, it's not as matte as the Tiso. The Tiso is also like a primer, as I said, but Epions, you get like that really dewy look. So if you're after that, I really recommend Epions SPF 50, and it's the Daily Shield that is tinted. So with the Epion's Daily Shield, you get a dewy look, but you get more of the cooler tone um, with this one. It's not a primer, but you really get a good dewy, like almost foundation-like um, cover when you put it on. Okay, so I wanted to show you the difference in color. So with the Epion's that I said, it's a dewy look, you get um, a little bit of cooler tones um, with it. So if you can see, that's how that one look. It's like a creamier um, texture to it. And then the tea, so I'm gonna put it next to it so you can see the difference in color. Yeah, you can definitely see a big difference. Um, so, and that's the Tiso. I know this one looks super dark on me, but it's not that dark when you uh, rub it in. So I'm gonna do that so you can <laughs> see um, that it's not getting dark. It's just like more like a warmer tone compared to the, um, the Epions. Okay, so you can't really see the difference now though, but that's where I have the Epions and here is where I have the Tiso. So you can see it's really good on fair skin, both of these. I don't know if you see like a big difference here, but um, the Tiso is a little bit more silky in the texture just because it have that a primer function too. So when you put that on, you put makeup on top of it, it's awesome. And then uh, again, the Epions is super dewy and nice. So it's definitely a preference, you know, what you like on your skin. But these two are my favorites. So I definitely recommend them, um, both of them. Epions actually have the Skin Cancer Foundation uh, recommendation on it. The Tiso, I don't think they do. No, that's so strange, but it's really, really good. So these two are my favorites and for a good sunblock. So I almost forgot. Uh, how much sunblock do you do put on on your face? For your face, you put on a teaspoonful. Yes, I said a teaspoonful. So that's how much you put on on your face. Uh, you massage it in and then you let it sit for a minute and then you massage it in a little bit more. So that is a lot, but if you want full coverage, that's how much you actually do put on. So one teaspoon for the face and obviously many more teaspoons for your body.